Hi there, so in this video we are going to take a look at random numbers in Mathematica. So first thing, open Mathematica and then create new notebook. Now inside our notebook, we are going to first create random integer from 1 to 10. And for this, we are going to make use of random integer function. So random and then it will search for integer function so random integer within square bracket we are going to use curly bracket and set range from 1 to 10 from which it will try to find one random number shift enter and it selected 9 if you run the function again and it will try to find a different value okay as you can see this time it shows 3 now what if you want to limit your range from 0 to 5 in such case you don't have to manually type 0 simply point a random integer function to 5 so it starts from 0 and ends on 5 and it selected 1 okay now what if you want to just choose between 0 or 1 those binary choices so for that random integer then keep your function empty and shift enter and it will return you with either 0 or 1 randomly depending on Mathematica's algorithm now if you want to create a random array so we will have that option too so simply start with random integer function within square bracket we will give it array full of one and zeros and it should be three by four array okay So let me properly close this and now we will hit shift enter and you see you get this array with random 1 and 0 1 and 0 if you run this again okay you will have another random array okay so you will find that there is nothing common in between the two so what we have seen so far is choosing random integer between range 1 to 10 then choosing from 0 to 5 and then choosing between 0 and 1 and then creating an array with random zeros and ones and then we will take a look at a few more examples here now if you want to work on real and complex numbers then you have function called a random real here you get to choose random real number so shift enter and you get 0 0.4789 and if you want to have a specific range for this then simply choose random real and you have to mention the range here so let's say I want to find out from minus 10 to 10 Okay, so I purposefully selected negative number. Okay, now shift enter and you have minus 2 as a random real output. Now similarly, you can do the same for random complex. Okay, so select that, start your square bracket, end it, keep it blank so that we can get a random value using Mathematica's own algorithm and you got your complex number with real and imaginary part okay so what we have seen so far is first we seen how to select number from range then how to select number starting from zero to that range then letting Mathematica choose its own random integer then let Mathematica create an array with random zeros and ones of our specified 
array range okay then we check random real function and random real function with specific range and finally a random complex number function okay so this was some of the example right here for generating random numbers in Mathematica.